In this video, we're heading out two days after the hurricane just hit the South Florida coast. We're going to see what we can get, hopefully put some fish in the box since it's been a couple of days with really bad weather, so I'm just glad we can be on the water. If you're new to the channel, my name's Austin. Welcome back to Barjax, the family fishing channel, baby. Let's get into it. So we start off by hooking up our sea witch with our Bonita strip. Once I got that all set up, I put on my number six planer. We were running a six and a four with one top line today. And that was kind of our spread. And we were just going to troll back and forth from 100 to 300 to see what we get. All right, guys. We just got hit. First fish of the day. Number six planer. It is a beautiful day after the hurricane. What the? Is that in the back? Yep, that's him. He just jumped. Did he get off? Oh, you're on here. Oh, oh my god. Oh my god. Okay. All right. Okay, I got it. I got it. Yeah. I'll do it. Yeah. Just watch that boat. I need to attend to the drum. That's right. Just finish up. Leave it alone. Is that a banana? Oh, what the heck? Whatever I have, it's most likely what you have. It might be in the tuna family, guys. I hope so. Oh, king. You guys want it? The king? Oh, it is. It was 24, I'll take it. Oh. Oh, yeah. Nice. All right, come here and finish this one off. Nice hit. We got hit on the six and we got hit on the top lure. Actually, not bad. Go, H. Yeah. Here he comes. I don't know. Whatever it is, that is a micro. Oh my god. That's the smallest thing I've ever seen. What the? What is that? Oh my oh, god. Yeah. That's that Wait, that's good bait. That is great bait. Actually, let's use him. We're on round two, baby. Got a king in the box, Benita. Am I the bet? Probably another Benita? Oh, I don't know. We were in about 120. I'm guessing it could be another king. Like 90% sure, but we'll see. Maybe it's a tuna. Could be a favorite part of fishing is not knowing what you caught. Could be a tuna. Like the Crocker Jack Could be a tuna. Nobody knows what the toy is. Better take this out one. Look how small Benita is. Are we going to do some shark fishing? That's actually perfect for some shark fishing. Oh my god. Yeah, to keep them. I know we don't usually keep the little guys, but this time we're, we're going to do a little shark fishing. Hey, that is. Hey, that. Yeah. Torpedo. Never fails me, baby. Just got hooked up. Second drop. Oh my gosh. Yeah, man. Yeah, oh my gosh. Woo hoo hoo! Doing a little. Oh, there we go. What's that? Oh! He saw the boat and he's not happy. Figured it out. What is this? Pinwheel and it's either a tin or a bonita. Oh, he's running. He is running. Tuna! Tuna, get ready with the gap! Damn. Get him over here! Move, don't move, don't move. Yeah. Nice blackfin, baby! On the jig! Second drop, Johnny Jig, baby! Yeah, we got our kinkfish, we're gonna start with the tuna, so come on over here. Initial cut, like we usually do. Ooh, that new nice sharpener feels good, let me tell you. Right in the back. All the way down. All the way down. Right along in the spine. I do the same thing here. Woo! Oh my gosh. Wow. Wow, 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 wow. Voila. I guess. We're getting a little fun. How about this mini rod? It actually folds up into a pen. I don't know. Oh, oh, he's there, he's there. Come on, come on, come on. Oh. 
we got him, we got him. Oh, the mini rod. Oh, the mini rod. Oh. Yeah. Alright, guys, now that we had our fun, we come back over here. Got two tuna fillets. I'm just gonna work. Burn your knife. Tuna fillets, and we're gonna do the same thing with this one. So let's get the kingfish. We'll show you guys the kingfish next. Cut right down the back. Make my outline. All the way, look at that. Once you have both sides cut, just slides like that. If you guys enjoyed this video, don't forget to like and subscribe, and we'll see you guys in the next project.